Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Capricorn Goddess. I hope all of you guys are doing well. This is going to be a late night collective reading. So if this message resonates to you, great. If not, please don't force the messages, guys. Let's go ahead and tap in. I was feeling a sense of rejection. Somebody could be feeling rejected by you at this time, collective, or this is you feeling rejected by someone. Take it as it resonates to you and your story. Let's see what comes out. We're going to start with the Hidden Truths Oracle tonight. Let's go ahead and tap in. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what messages do you have for the collective? What do my collective need to know at this time? Late night messages for the collective. What do my collective need to know at this time? Okay, we got family roots coming out. High headed at the bottom of the deck. I knew it. Some of you guys can be dealing with a fire sign here. Look, we got a beautiful lover. I'm telling you, I feel like somebody feels rejected by you. This could be someone that's very abusive, collective. This could be someone you also had a family with or you have one with currently. I feel like there's something, they're saying rooted. Something's rooted between the two of you guys like I said some of you guys could have like a family with this person let's see yeah look separation hurts so some of you guys are definitely in separation with someone yep emotionally unavailable someone could feel like you are being emotionally unavailable to them at this time collective take it as it resonates somebody feels like they no longer have access to you is what i'm hearing some of y'all could have flipped the script on somebody is what i'm also getting maybe in the past you were emotionally available to this person but something changed here somebody could have became very abusive here that's for somebody whether it was physically abusive mentally emotionally i'm getting emotionally abusive here somebody's mad because they cannot emotionally manipulate you anymore this is you because somebody closed off their feelings here or this was just this person's energy Somebody was emotionally abusive here. And now this person is mad. Let's see. Messages. Yeah, I'm getting a lot. Yep. Dwelling on an old lover. So for some of you guys, this person treated you as if they were emotionally unavailable. Because for some of you guys, they were dealing with an old lover. They were dwelling on someone from their past. This is why this person was not available to you emotionally. I feel like we received this message before. Let's see. What else? Passion extinguishing. So there could have been a lot of sexual passion between the two of you guys. I feel like now that this person has no access to you, I feel like there's some sort of passion that's like coming over this person I'm, I'm hearing. Yeah, we got heart and knots. This could definitely be a fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. This person definitely feels, they feel what you could have felt before collective. They feel that you pull back your energy here. That's for somebody. Yeah, some of you guys can be dealing with a Gemini. Don't have to be. Let's see what else. 
comes out for you guys. What messages do you have for the collective? Messages for my collective. What do my collective need to know at this time? That they're watching you. Somebody's watching you. They're stalking you. We got divine masculine coming out. So, <laughs> for some of you guys, this is a masculine energy. Sorry, I dropped some cards. So, for some of you guys, this is definitely a masculine energy. We got divine masculine. And we have, I want to hold you. So, yeah, this was somebody that was definitely emotionally unavailable. They were closed off to you. But now I feel like this person is in their emotions. It says thinking of a way to get back into your life. So this person is thinking of a way to get back into your life, collective, whoever you are. This is a masculine energy. We have transformation, karma slash change. So for some of you guys, this could be a Scorpio energy. Don't have to be, but I feel like this person is going through some sort of transformation here. For some of you guys, this person could have even received some sort of karma here. They're going through a major transition, I'm hearing. It says, I wish I could tell you how I feel. I'm telling you. So, basically, whoever this person was that was emotionally unavailable to you and emotionally manipulative as well, this person wishes they could have told you how they feel. Let's see. So, you could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Leo Aries Sagittarius. Let's see. What messages do you have for the collective late night reading? What messages do you have for the collective? It says, I never wanted you to leave, but I know that I mistreated you. I'm telling you, some of y'all left whoever this person was. This was a masculine energy. If you are a divine masculine watching this, you could have left the feminine. Take it as it resonates. Maybe this feminine was too dominant. This feminine could have definitely um, could have been emotionally unavailable to you as well. Somebody was easily uh, mad here. Like they were um, very... Uh, I can't even get my thoughts together. This is somebody that was hot, like tempered. How do you say it? Um, quick tempered? This is somebody that was quick to get upset, is what I'm saying. What else is this? Yeah, we got a new house. So for some of you guys, this person could have got a new home, or this is you. Maybe somebody is upset that you you got a new home. Yeah, it says you please me. Look, let's move in together. So you could have actually lived with this person. Okay, or this person could have always like talked about you guys moving in together. But some of you guys are like contemplating about moving with this person because of their actions here. What is this? These are not supposed to be here, but I can't get over you. And we got Sagittarius and we got the Empress. So whoever you are, you're definitely coming out as the Empress. This could definitely be somebody that you could have children with. Okay. This person feels as if they can't get over you. We got fatal attraction here, so they're definitely attracted to you, whoever you are. But I just feels like somebody's kind of frustrated and upset that they're not getting the same attention that they were once getting from you. Yeah, look, 
officially missing you. So, yeah, for some of you guys, this could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We got envious slash jealousy. And we got hater alert. So, there could have been an air sign in the mix here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? For some of y'all, this could have been a third party. Let's see. There was some jealousy here. This person is very jealous over you. Or this is you. It's like this person don't want anybody around you. Don't want anybody talking to you if they have no access to you. Yeah, what is love to a broken heart? Somebody could be a Virgo here. Taurus or Capricorn. What else is this for the collective? We got money coming in. Alright, what else? It says, I watch your social media and bend over. Ooh. So, whoever this person is, they're definitely watching you. They're stalking you. They're remembering um, the sex that you two could have had together. That's for somebody. Let's go ahead and tap into the tarot. Let's see. What messages do you have for the collective? What messages do you have for the collective? What do my collective need to know? Who is this that's watching the collective social media? Who is this that's watching the collective social media? We got judgment. So, for some of you guys, this could definitely be a Scorpio that's heartbroken here. Some of y'all call judgment on this person. Some of you guys really got fed up with this person, I'm feeling like. And you call judgment on this situation. Now this person is in the Three of Swords. Yeah, we got justice. Some of you guys, this could have been a Libra. This person is heartbroken. I do feel like they want to uh, balance the scales out with you, but something is definitely over here. If you are not the one who called judgment here, collective, this was definitely the universe. The universe got tired of seeing this person mistreating you, whoever you are, collective. Yep, look, tower. Heavy on the Scorpio. Yeah, look. Knight of Swords. The universe got tired of this person mistreating you. King of Swords in reverse. This is somebody that's very nasty, very arrogant, very cocky type of energy. I heard smart ass. So this is somebody that just knew, knew it all, okay, is what I'm hearing. Or thought they knew it all. What is this for the collective? <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. I don't know. I sneeze in your reading. So that could be significant. We got the nine of cups with the world. Yeah. I feel like you guys have ended it. I feel like you guys are focused on yourself. You are fulfilled within yourself, whoever you are, collected with the world card. I feel like some of you guys are cool with this ending because some of you guys feel like this person, they dogged you out. That's what I see. This is somebody that was nasty. They didn't deserve your energy. They didn't give you nothing here. Yeah, look. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. What is this? Yeah, Queen of Wands. They they are attracted to you, whoever you are. For some of you guys, this is definitely a fire sign. You can have fire in your chart. 
Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, but this person knows that it's over between the two of you guys. This person knows that they should have treated you better. Yep, four of cups. This person knows that they missed the opportunity with you, whoever you are. I just really feel like this person treated you guys shitty, but they got the nerve to be, like, fatally attracted to you. Like, this is crazy. They treated you as if you were nothing. As if you didn't deserve their feelings, their emotions. But now somebody is feeling your absence. That's what I'm feeling. Yeah, seven of wands. Death card. For some of y'all, this is Scorpio. No doubt about it. We got Scorpio here like three times. We got Death card, Seven of Wands. Some of y'all blocked the Scorpio or this person blocked you. They're feeling the loss of you. Yep, Queen of Swords, Five of Wands. This person feels like now you're being cold towards them. So basically, the person that treated you cold feels like you're treating them cold now. They're feeling the way they wanted you to feel. If that makes sense. Like, and this is bringing them to like some type of conflict. Like, for some of y'all, they want to fight. Like, they don't like this. Oh, how the tables have turned is what I'm hearing. Yeah, Ace of Wands. They don't, you don't want a new beginning with this person. Yeah, Three of Wands. Somebody feels like rejected by you. I'm hearing sorrow. This could be somebody from your past. Six of Cups. Yeah, all they can do is watch you. They're stalking you. They're watching your social media. Wishing they had access to you. Yeah, the lovers. For some of you guys, this could be a Gemini. But also, this is giving third party. So look, four of this. Yeah, somebody feels like they missed a whole opportunity to like have a family with you. The strength card could be dealing with a Leo. Whoever you are, this person was cocky. Straight par with the lovers. This person was cocky. Let's see what else you guys need to know. And we're going to tap out of this reading. Yeah, so basically, whoever this was that was cold to you, they now feel like you're being cold to them. Look, we got Blessings, and we got Virgo, and we got Why Are You Always On My Mind. So for some of you guys, this could be a Virgo energy. This person also knows that you have some type of Blessings coming in too, collected. So for some of you guys, this is why they feel rejected. They feel like they should share these blessings with you. We got 333. Some of you guys could be seeing 3333. What else? Yeah, we got water sign. I'm telling y'all, for some of y'all, this is a Scorpio. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. This person cannot stop thinking about you. Some of y'all really block this person. I'm here and block this person out of your life. We got Sag here. Somebody can have Sagittarius in their chart. Look, we got a sleep around energy. So for some of y'all, this person's a sleep around energy. Like, they for everybody. What else is this? We got trigger warning. So for some of you guys... You guys are going to find out that there was a third party here that this person was dealing with. This could be some sort of trigger warning for you guys. We got young men. So this is somebody that was young. 
You could be an older feminine energy dealing with this person. You could be older than this masculine. We got cancer. Okay. What messages do you have for the collective? It said you are not from around here. Alien vibes. So whoever you are, you can have cancer in your chart. Or this person does. Somebody feels like you are not from around here. Like you give off those alien vibes collective. Like you're just a rare breed I'm hearing. And this person sees that there's nobody else like you. And this person is definitely feeling the way they made you feel. So take this message as it resonates to you and your story collective i hope this helps somebody out there okay please like share and subscribe to my channel if you guys enjoy my readings take care